Oh my god. It's time. What is it time for? Time for Florida's Mind? Yeah, I think it's pretty fair to say yeah. so. It is pre-travel day, so thank you for watching it. Uh -oh. um, tomorrow is obviously travel day. We're going to the Block Hotel tonight. Um, I say tonight, we're actually leaving shortly. Uh, and we're we'll trying to get there early just because the sun sets really early. Um, and we want to make sure that we can catch some sunlight where the planes are going through it. And watch the sunset over the planes. Because it's like we don't get sends from like once a year. So it's quite nice to like spend a good amount of time there. Yeah, absolutely. So I hope you enjoyed the vlogs. I hope you enjoyed the whole vlog series. Um, there'll be a new video every single week. And we will see you when we're all packed up and in the car. Uh, are you excited? I'm so excited. Are you? Let's go! What <laughs> <laughs> are you crazy? It's time! Let's do this. Oh, it's so heavy. I get to drive your car today. Yeah, you do. You get to become the newest member of the Volkswagen group. I know. You're so cool. I know. I'm carless. We have to lay them down, remember? Right. Well, we actually haven't played Tetris in this car yet, but I think it would be better if we laid them down, maybe. Do you reckon? I reckon the next ones will go in. Do you reckon? Try. Woo -hoo. Also, we have a little passenger here. Hello. <laughs> You're going to Nanny's house. You're going to Nanny's house. He's like, what's happening? Why am I here? Yours is so heavy. I know, it's because I've got loads of your stuff in it. Question, how many pairs is too many pairs of shoes? Because Ryan has packed five. Yeah. And <laughs> look at that. It's like a glove. Nailed like a it. Glove. Woo! Should we go? <laughs> We're on our way! We made it, we made it. We got Gabby in the back there. Hey Nubby. He's like, I know where I'm going. <laughs> and I'm not happy about I'm it. I'm not happy about the fact the suitcase is all loaded up. They fit really well. So well. They did fit really well. Take so, one for the win. So we've got two hours to go, oh, sorry, two hours, one hour to go till we can drop Gav off at Anastasia's mum's and then it's about an hour and a half from there to Gatwick. So for those of you who have watched our previous vlogs, our previous vlog series, you'll know that Anastasia's mum lives opposite Stansted Airport, which is really annoying that we have to go to an airport to go to a different airport. Yeah, it also feels really weird. I've never been passenger in my own car before and Ryan's also never driven my car before. So this is really fun. I feel like a proper passenger princess. Yeah, you've driven my car before. Yeah. I've never driven yours, so. I know. It's alright, actually. Folks, I can see yourself on. Yeah. Good stuff. Of food from MS. I learned my lesson from the last vlog. If you watch, what is it, April's pre travel day, April and November, Anastasia gets very grumpy when she's hungry. But it's because we don't eat on travel day or like pre travel day. We're, we're so busy doing everything else. Like this morning, we like finished packing, like we showered, you went for a run, like we did go for a walk, and it's now like 10 past 12, and all we've eaten is the donut. <laughs> Krispy Kreme donuts for breakfast. So, uh, what did you get? She's run into MS and got. I got you a chicken and bacon wrap, and mm. I got a hoist and duck wrap. Nice. Do you want to go half these or? I don't mind. However, you like to go. And then I got you some sensation crisps, and I got some Reese's peanut butter. And then I got best had coffee each because these are the best iced coffees in the world. They are. Uh, and then I just got a bottle of water because um, I have to stay hydrated. Stay hydrated. Hey, Gav. God, he hates himself. He's really. <laughs> <laughs> He's so upset with us. He He's rolled. He's been really sad all day, but... So we're going to eat this, and we're, like, uh, 11 minutes away from Anastasia's mum. So we're going to eat this now, and then drop Gavi boy off. I'm going to miss him. Oh, I'm going to miss him so much, too. He has no idea. Actually, he does have no idea. And we've got a magic band on. Because, you know... <laughs> power, power. So, um, a bit of a plot twist, though. What I will say is we're not staying in the same room as before. Because we did get the upgrade. What, the... The runway suite. No, we didn't, did we? We did, I booked it. 
Oh my god, did we? Yeah, I got it. No way. I got it straight away, but I didn't want to take the surprise for you. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Let's go. <laughs> I'm still so excited about the room news. I know I was so excited for you. It has been so tough to not get so excited and so tough not to tell you. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we spoke about it. I think if you follow our Instagram, we mentioned it on there. We spoke about it, what, maybe four or five days ago? Yeah. Yeah. So Gav's dropped off. We're now going to head to uh, the Purple Park in meet and greet. So the last two times we've come to Florida, we've done the Purple Park and we ride a bus, whereas this time we're parking in the actual airport and then they're going to take the car and, and so on because it was about five pound more or something like that so yeah. hopefully that's better we looked yesterday at the timestamp between um dropping the car off and getting to the airport and it was about an hour yeah. so it'd be interesting to see how long this takes so yeah so this one we have to go to the orange parking we have to call them 15 minutes before we arrive and they're gonna park the car for us and when we get back we'll call them and then they'll bring us the car so it'll be nice and easy actually rather than getting a bus and stuff yeah hopefully so so we've set the nav up we should get there about two o'clock and we'll film on the way when we get there who knows who knows you're gonna find out right now Time is like an ocean, singular but broken, and we are wooden pegs on a board. level one at the purple park and drop off bit uh, it is that's a magic band that doesn't tell me the time is what is that uh, 201 so we'll see how long it takes to get from here to our room because last time it took 50 minutes 50 minutes from the purple car park where you get a bus so fingers crossed are you excited so excited are you yes. <laughs> so excited this is us let's go We haven't just reused it. This is our own fish. How long did it take? Uh, nine minutes, including stopping for photos, which we'll insert. <laughs> There's more, but it smells so good in this hotel. So we have uh, got to the block hotel. We just need to go to. I can't remember what level it was. We messed up last time. We want to go to three. level three, not level five. That's what we did last time. <laughs> I don't know why. We were just like hotel rooms 500 to six, uh, 589. That so sounds right. Our last hotel was 6 at 48, I think it was, which was yes. the pre VIP, VIP room. But this time, and so just surprised me with the runway. So we, and it is going to be freaking 
Sweet. <laughs> to the top. One thing that we love about this room, this hotel, is that it's although so the staff, so well, I was going to say the staff are so friendly as well. Yeah. So we get 20% off with the spoons and 10% off cafe nero, don't we? And VIP security. Yeah. Um, yeah. Premium security. You have, to, you have to ask for that and they just throw it in, it's fine. Yeah. Um, but there is only one. This is a mic. Oh, we have stuff. Scan the card, you Wally. Um, there's only one. Um, suite. Yeah, there's only one suite in the whole, in the whole hotel. So. We've and the, it's us. We've got the only room that's got it, and that is us. It's an 848, and I'm excited. I'm going to show you. We are here. We are. We've got the runway. We're just going to leave our luggage out here for a bit, because we're the only... There's one room there, but it doesn't matter. Are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. So, we did film before last time when we went to the premium room. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God, Moon, it's so cool. <gasps> it's so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, look that's at this. That's what she said. Wow! Oh my look at goodness! The this window oh is so much God. bigger than it was before. Yeah, it is. How do we pull it all across? I don't wow. know. Isn't it all done by the app? It might be. I don't know. Oh. Wow, look how big the window is. It's so much bigger than the other one. I feel like we're closer. Yeah. Even though we're higher. Maybe it's because we are higher. It feels closer. Because the other one, you get somewhat of an obstructed view, don't you? Do you reckon that bone's about to take off? I don't know, but I'm so happy with that it. One. <laughs> The bedroom looks amazing. So there's like padding like all on the ceiling. Uh, and there's a whole Sonos move in here, which is pretty awesome. Ryan said he's going to take it with us, but he's definitely not because my card's on this reservation. <laughs> Happy birthday. These, we've got a room and we've got the ones and we've got the... Uh, a five. Oh, no, and a five. Beam. A five that is just in the cupboard. In the box. Yeah. You're the worst. Oh, no. But it's called these cool lights. I love these lights here. Yeah. Last time, I think first yeah. time we stayed here, we were like, oh, they're cubes. And took us ages to work out. Oh my God, they're blocks. We're in the block hotel. <laughs> it makes so much more sense that there would be blocks. So everything is um, know, done by the tablets, isn't it? It's all controlled by the yeah, tablets. Yeah, I think so. Make the windows go up higher. And they left us this really lovely note. So this is technically our honeymoon. Um, and they left a lovely little note to say congratulations on your honeymoon. And that this is why they are the best hotel. This is why we recommend everyone stays here whenever we come. And you also get free snacks. Sudden like a rainstorm, a voice it pours from heaven. Is this your final welcome home? for sure. What are you doing? Just making a cool glass of prosecco for That's us. That's a nice, nice chilled one, are you? You can tell I had a brother because you have to make sure it's level. Absolutely perfectly level. Yeah. Also, you can tell you have me as a husband who's like, they're not level. You can take your shoes off. I am going to take my shoes off because the floor is... One of the most exciting things that we were looking forward to, and this is going to sound really, really, really stupid, is the noise that the floor makes. Go then, run. <laughs> Like, literally, anyway, since around, like, hey, there's one thing I've got to do, and there's a jump on the bed, and I was like, in a second, but... You also haven't jumped on the bed. <laughs> 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 Good work. I keep thinking this is another room, it's a mirror. Your turn. Did a flip. You did a flip. Good flipping skills. What do you think? I love this room so much. It is good. It is really, really good. And we've just got, just, we're just sitting here, a couple of drinks, there's some music playing, but every time we film it turns off on the move. What I will say is, you can really see the difference in size between like the international airlines, like the, the long ones yeah. and the short ones, because there was um, a Saudi Arabian one that went past earlier and behind it was an easy jet you could like barely see the easy jet yeah. behind it because it was so it small. was probably half the size didn't realize how big the, the big ones really are um despite the fact that we've been in like this sort of style room a couple of times and yeah. you know, we're going on a plane like regularly but yeah it's weird when you see them so close together how big some of them are yeah and the Saudi Arabian one was massive wasn't it like it's it was a really, really big plane. It was so. a chunky boy. It was Just a chunky a boy. boy. So, yeah, we're going to listen to some music. We're going to have some drinks. We've got some cocktails in the fridge. And then we'll probably film when we do something funny. Or if we never see any more footage again, then you know why, because we're not funny. 
Um, but maybe when we go get some food or some drinks, we're going to go see if there's anywhere that's showing football in a bit. Because Anastasia, Anastasia loves it and I get dragged mm. along. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Because you're filming on my phone. <laughs> you are drunk. Do you know what the best thing was, right? We were texting my friend who's flying from Sandston today. And Brian was tracking their flights. <laughs> not even any of the ones that we can see. Yeah, I, was was like... <laughs> I was looking at what was taken off from Stansted rather than watching ours. So... Um, that one was going to Oslo over there, one just come from Athens. Well, I would like to say, and if you've watched our vlogs before, you know what I'm going to say. Prosecco gets Prosecco us drunk. Prosecco makes us drunk. There's still a little bit in this bottle and we already feel it. We've got a whole other bottle and six, six <laughs> you know, cocktails. You know when you're starting to get a little bit drunk and you, you feel hot? Makes my tummy cold. Yeah, that's weird. My tummy gets hot, my tummy gets cold. Yeah, my tummy feels cold when I get drunk. It. But yeah, we're just tracking, we've been sat here for, I don't even know what the time is. We've just been sat here for probably like an hour, hour and a half, maybe. Half three. Half three, so yeah, we've been sat here for about an hour. Also, look, can you look at that, um, is it Malaysian, did you say, flight over there? And look how small the ones are next to Oh, them. yeah, and let me zoom in. Because you can't really like, you know what we said earlier about how like small they look? It just looks like a... Look at the plane next to it. Like a massive one compared to it. That one versus Ooh, that one. Shadow. <laughs> look at this easy jet little number. Then look at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's three times as big. It dwarfs it. We were we did actually look yesterday, and we could have upgraded our seats to for two hundred and fifty pound for each. business yeah. class. But we thought that um, like we weren't sure whether we were going to sit together, and yeah. to be honest, like it seemed like a lot of extra money. So I don't think five hundred pound is a lot for the upgrade, but I no. just I think that we're very happy with it. like we're in premium economy. Uh, and we're back row, aren't we? So we can lean yeah. back. I think we're happy in our seats. I mean, Anastasia's like five foot four, so and I'm and I'm five foot six and a half, so we're yeah. all, we're all right. And we have already inquired to book this room for when we go in April next year. So don't worry, guys. We we'll might be back, be back here in a few months. Wait, where you been? Hang on. <laughs> London to Bridgetown. Oh, you can't see that. That's really uh, sucky down to Cape Town, and that one's been from Belfast to London. You'd be pleased to know. I don't know if you can see it taking off. Welcome God, to, uh, this is drunk footage. This is this is, this is what my afternoon has been like. This is one that's gone from Belfast. <laughs> this one's going to Athens. <laughs> oh dear. Right, well, I don't know what's happening now. I'm a bit drunk. <laughs> You've had one and a half glasses of Prosecco. Tee I did read online some of that. Someone said we're lightweights. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I, do you know what? I completely agree. I've, I couldn't agree more. I have no idea what they're on about. <laughs> do you know what that means? It's cheap. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Not Face glued to the iPad. <laughs> so we're calling it that right there that you can see saw. Some good footage. Yeah, solid bottle and a half of Prosecco and a couple of cocktails. This plane here. We reckon it's our one. God, this is the worst footage ever. <laughs> this one, though we might not even enter into the vlogs, is our plane. I reckon so. It's been here since we've been here. Yeah. I reckon so. I can't see anything that's arriving, so we'll see. If not, we'll see. We'll see. We'll also, get some food. absolutely yes. Have we been sitting in the dark? Like, it's, yes, of course we have. Why would we not? Because if we turn lights on, then we get reflections. If we don't turn lights on, then this is the view. So, this is what we're sitting with. Yeah, otherwise, we'd get reflections. Hey, and who's that handsome devil? <laughs> it's you. Um, otherwise, this is what it get. So, why would we not sit in the dark? Yeah. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna go down to the weather spoons and get some food because giraffe is cold. Closed. Cold. <laughs> uh, we could go to North Terminal, but people keep telling us there's nothing good over there. So we're gonna go to the weather spoons. And we've been over there in the past, haven't we? And there's not there is actually nothing good over there. There is a singular restaurant over there, isn't there? But that is it. So we'll go down to the weather spoons. We'll find something, whether it's just some chips or. Um, 
something. You have lasagna probably. But... I don't I don't want, for some reason he's got you know, said that I want lasagna for dinner. But like even when we cook but lasagna there. I don't even want lasagna they're, because the pasta is never ever cooked properly. They have pizzas down there, so we'll have maybe like a pizza or something like that. Maybe or pizza or, or chips or, or a panini or something. You're about to find out in No. We'll film between now and then. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Yes. Where are we going? Uh, we're going to go down and get some. Food. We're going to the exit. Uh, let's start only that way. We're in a secret little sneak section. We are. So we've got this whole hallway, and then there's one room, and then there's us. So we're going to go find some food. After you, my dear. I would say that this room, this floor, doesn't oh, smell. Do you feel like I don't feel like it smells like anything? That might be you too, fair. I do smell fabulous. You do smell. <laughs> so windswept. <laughs> Elvis. My personality. Oh. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just heading to um, Weatherspoons to go get some food. Which is on the third floor. It's really busy. Like you forget really busy. when you sit in like a silent hotel room. I say silent, we have music on, but there's no one in the hotel room. Are you sure it's the right way? Yeah. No. Sure. I think she's letting us the wrong way. Yeah. She's definitely letting us the wrong way. Um, so when you've I don't been, know where I am. so when you've um, been in the hotel room with just music. <laughs> so when you've been in the hotel room and it's just music playing, and then go downstairs and there's people everywhere. Like you forget that you're in an airport, mm. like you actually do, and it's really weird to think that like all these like hustle and muscle is behind you, like underneath you. Yeah, like we were only over there. Awesome. <laughs> I'm too easily distracted for an Very distractible. Yeah, so, um, yeah, it's busy. Busy down here. Really, yeah. really, really busy. Also, it's weird to think that, like, people have midday flights. Like, we only ever fly first thing in, in the, the morning, morning but then we're, late at night. We've got 11.30 flight tomorrow. Yeah, no, but, like, do you think it's weird that people fly at, like, 4 o'clock in the afternoon? Yeah, where are you going to fly at 4 o'clock in the afternoon? Why are you going to Milan at like 5 in the afternoon? But then also, we Me. fly back at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Fly back from Florida. True. Who it's knows? Just, it's just crazy. It's just craziness. Madness. Pure, pure Ab madness. Absolute bonkersness. <laughs> we have got a pretty good room. No, wait, hold on. We've got a pretty good view. Take two. Hehe. <laughs> I think I'm... I'm right at the Mother Spoons. Do you want something different to drink other than your cocktail? Do you want like a vodka lime lemonade or anything like that? Or do you just want a cocktail? Mm. Yes. 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 What'd you get? Uh, I ordered a pepperoni pizza. You've got a meat feast. I've got a pitcher of cocktails. And you've, you've got, got the candy the rosa one. one. This manly little number over here. Yeah, nice. Uh, and you've got two vodka lime and lemonades. Just because I can't drink Monster. No, you get heart palpitations. Yeah. Um, and we've got quite a cool view down here, actually. Yes, you do. It's weird to think that, like, how empty this is right now. I hate that. This is how busy it was up there. Yeah. Yeah, true. Are you hungry yet? Yeah, I'm getting hungry. I'm excited for a pizza. I think as soon as I smell food, I'll be hungry. Yeah, be good. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Me too. So we've got some food, and I said you got ID'd for our alcohol. I had to go to the room and go get her ID. I did. I'm 27 and got ID'd, so luckily the mus um, moisturizer was working, right? Yeah, you look young for your age, right? Yeah. You don't look 18, mind you, but. I, I, I don't look 18, you don't but. You look 17. No. If you looked 18, you'd be fine. I'm going to collect my pizza. Me too. Let's eat. It's not like Disney. <laughs> Who are you waving at? Well, they're not waving back, so no one apparently. Literally anyone. Anyone, anyone of these back. people. I'll wave back. I'll wave at. We've just edited our sleep schedule yep, to turn true. that off because obviously we're not going to be waking up at like 6 a.m. every day. Well, we probably will be, but we just don't know. So we're just going to do like daily alarms, aren't we? So yeah. we'll set our alarm for 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. Our flight's not until 11.25 and we're already in the airport. So, However, hold like up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. What time do you think we'll be awake? Because I reckon 3.25. Based on the fact that we woke up at 5 a.m. this morning, excited for today, which is 
pre-travel day. I think, um, yeah, I do think we'll be excited, but I don't know. I think 6 a.m., be ready by 7, half 7, out of the room. It's three out, four hours, so I think that's too early, but we'll be awake before 6. But. I reckon we'll be awake at 3, and then, or like half 3, and then we'll fall back to sleep. Until and then six. wake up until like half five-ish. Yeah, that'd be good. Who knows, at least it gives us time to get ready in the morning. I'm very excited though. Me too. I'm already excited because when we wake up, we go to Disney World today. Like when we wake up. Yeah, no, none of this. So we've been saying like, we've been walking our dog and we've been like, oh, three weeks today we'll be in Islands Adventure. Three weeks today it's pre-travel day. Three weeks today it's travel day. Three weeks today it's pre-pre-travel day. Tomorrow is travel day. We've also been doing like three weeks today, it's pre 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 travel day in seven hours time. So like it's actually crazy that when we wake up in the morning we actually go to Florida yeah. that evening and that afternoon. Yeah, I'm excited. So tomorrow we've got big plans, so make sure you check out that vlog. But the next thing you probably see is us getting ready to go to bed. But it's only half seven, but we're tired. We are so tired. We wake up at like what half five this morning ish. Yeah, our dog woke us up at five to five this morning. Then we watched Goblet of Fire and well, fell asleep we during of, it. We put it on and then fell asleep shortly after we put it on and then wake up at like half six ish. But yeah, we're tired. Our eyes are stinging. So Anastasia is double parked. I've got a picture. We'll finish these and we'll get up into bed. So we'll film it when we get there. We're going to go to British Airways. We're not going to bother. Yeah, we'll go to British Airways. Yeah. Because we've got our boarding passes, but it also says that our uh, passports need to be checked. checked so. so let's. we might as well get checked out now, right? Yeah, because we haven't got four hours in the morning to do that. Yeah, no time in the morning, all the time this evening. Are you ready? You ran away from me. Wait, yeah, it's that way. I thought we'd come past it. A brand new island everywhere we go. Welcome to my crib. So we've just got to the British Airways uh, section. We're thinking about just having a quick chat about seeing how much it would cost to upgrade. So we got a notification for earlier, it's £250 a person to upgrade our flights, but I wonder if there's like a sneaky little special deal that they might be able to do. So we're gonna speak yes. to them now and see what happens. Hey, so we've got our tickets to ride. So uh, we are premium economy. However, um, she said about coming tomorrow morning, so we might be able to upgrade for like £80 or so. Yes. And if it's £80 to go to yeah business class which is the one with like the seats lay down and stuff would probably do it how much extra yeah. would you pay to go to the level up from what you are where is the lay down seats for like 150 pounds what per person yeah like it depends if they're, if they're together yeah if yes. the seats are together 150 pounds like, a person i think it'd be fun if not then no um thing is we're back row on the premium economy seats so um, we can lean back, no one's going to, like, not that anyone, I, I don't think anyone would ever tell you not to lean back, but we could lean back and it wouldn't matter. Yeah. Um, I think we're probably too polite to lean back if people are behind us. Yeah, um, but we, what she, sorry, go on. Go on. Oh, she did also say that, like, everyone that's flying to America would have their uh, passport checks anyway, so yeah. it's not like we were just, like, flagged up for any reason. It's because she's a criminal. <laughs> Well, I think that pretty much wraps up our pre-travel day. So we hope you've absolutely loved the vlog. Um, like I said, there'll be a new video every week. And if you're watching this in one bingey session, pff, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, if you're watching in one bingey session, obviously, thank you for watching as well. Uh, and tomorrow we get to wake up. We go to Disney World. Tomorrow evening, what's our plans for tomorrow? So we land. At the car. We're going no, no, it's right. no, 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 hold on. So we land order our instacart yeah then drop our suitcases at the room go back to the lobby hopefully pick up our instacart strips and pizza pick up the instacart drop the stuff back at the room and then go to epcot on yeah. skyline and then go to disney springs do an amphi car and yeah, so, go to um boathouse yeah so um Epcot tomorrow, go get a bottle of a glass of Prosecco. Yeah. Because there's a particular Prosecco that we really like over there. It's so good. Hopefully ride one of the rides. We're happy to ride either Soaring, Guardians. Guardians are not particularly confident on because we'd have to hope that we can get a lightning lane, but yeah. we're not there for one o'clock, so it's unlikely. But hopefully ride Soaring or uh, Ratatouille. Mm -hmm. um, if we don't ride any rides in Epcot tomorrow, that's also fine. Yeah, we're there for two weeks. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we're going to go to Epcot, get a glass of Prosecco, then walk to Beaches and, no, sorry, uh, Yacht and Beach Club. Yeah. 
And then we've got a night booked at Disney Springs. So we have got an amphicar, which has kindly been uh, gifted to us by the boathouse. So kindly, yeah. It's like the first thing that we've ever been gifted. So it's like, it means a lot. Yeah, so we've kind of been gifted that by the boathouse. And then we've got dinner there um, as well. They've sort of set up a little bit of a spread for us, which is cool. So hopefully we should have some cocktails and some shrimp and some bread. Oh. But look how tired she is. So we're going to go to bed. It's super, super, super late now. I know we said in the vlog it's earlier... Not I'm just kidding. It's 8.30. It's, 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 it's 8.30. It's like literally 8.07. 8.07. Yeah. So we're going to get to bed. Uh, we're going to get cold up. We're going to wake up early tomorrow morning. And next time we see us, we're on our way to Disney World. Oh my God, I'm just so excited. This has been like a whole year planning this trip. It's not, we booked it in like March. Did we? No, we booked it to April and March. Either way, we haven't, been, so since, we haven't been since November last year. So we hope you enjoy it. Make sure you check out tomorrow's vlog because that's the travel day. That's the one everyone likes. Um, and we will see you in the morning. I'm going to go shower. I'm going to get into bed. Oh. And I cannot wait. We're going to do a little face mask. Yeah, I don't know what that is. But yeah, we're going to do that. Yes. So see you in the morning. Enjoy the vlog. Thank you for watching. And join us tomorrow or next week or whenever you're watching it. Join us next time for Travel Day Woo! to Florida. Let's go! I'm like a sailor on a ship with no home I'm left with one question burning my direction If I had a choice, which way would I go? Wam kele, wam kele Wam kele kele, wam kele, wam kele for sure